You've come from the European Union. What is the kind of help and aid that you're going to provide to Ukraine at this uh, moment of crisis? Well, we, we stand by Ukraine against this uh, unjustified and unprovoked aggression. And you, as you may have uh, read, uh, yesterday the European Council has agreed on a new package of sanctions. This is the second package of sanctions yes. in the space of a few days. So the sanctions are meant to isolate uh, Russia economically and politically and to make those who decided uh, to aggress Ukraine accountable for their actions. So we will continue to support uh, Ukraine at this dark hour and uh, it's important that the international community comes together in defense of the internet of international law and the rules based system of world governance. So what about the military protection that uh, currently President Zelensky is asking for? Uh, would the Euro European Union, along with the NATO nations, be able to provide that kind of support to fight off the Russian forces? Well, as, as I told you, we, we, have, uh, we, have, uh, we stand by Ukraine. We are giving the support, uh, maximum support, in terms of isolating Russia and making uh, Russia accountable politically when facing... Uh, the international community and in this respect the work ongoing at the UN is very important. Thank you so much for speaking to us sir and uh, uh, the representatives of uh, the European Union also outside uh, the Ukrainian embassy at the moment paying their respects to uh, those people who may have lost their lives uh, uh, in the Ukrainian aggression. We are uh, seeing a stream of representatives from various uh, uh, embassies, from uh, the Lithuanian embassy, from Sweden, from uh, the European Union as well and uh, as uh, the spokesperson just informed us, they are willing to provide uh, the kind of aid and assistance to Ukraine and uh, after putting out the second package of sanctions they are uh, trying to isolate Russia economically and politically but will it work uh, is another question meanwhile Ukrainians uh, continue to fight off the aggression and demand military support from European Union and uh, the NATO countries with Zia Udin in New Delhi Milan Sharma for India Today